All right, so we're here after the after stream report. <laughs> this is our second take at making this after stream report. Because Crazy forgot to remind me to switch it over to the Minecraft screen instead of the... Crazy hell, that's it's, you. It's, it's all Crazy's fault. Anyways, as the title of this video will say, mistakes were made. Crazy was a dumbass and gave me an ultimate turbine to put in our steam turbine. XAR was an idiot and didn't force me to go check the calculator that he was nice enough to make for us to make sure that our steam turbine could handle the extra EU we were going to get out from the cobalt rotor to the ultimate rotor. Just so you know, the cobalt rotor is shit crazy bring the other cobalt rotor over here 420 okay. um is 16k um liters a second of flow versus the ultimate which is 18k liters a second of flow so it's only 2000 liters an extra you have all but, the 10 percent more efficiency but due to the 10% more efficient, because the Cobalt one is 105, this one's 115, we went from, what was the numbers, 442 to Four, 5... 420. 420 to 517. Oops. And 517 just happens to be 5EU more than what a HV Dynamo hatch can handle. And it blew up our turbine... If you notice, the uh, ceiling looks a little strange here, and there's now black granite everywhere. We blew all of this out. We had to remake our battery buffer. It got blown up with all of the Lapatrons in it. And we have run ourselves out of methane again, so I need to shut that off right now. So I did some redecorating while Crazy remade all the things that I blew up. And you can see over here, we blew a huge hole in the side of this hill. I did the best I could to rebuild it and manicure it and make it look somewhat natural. But, you know. You did a pretty good job, I think. Um, When we get done, remind me to get this sent into the gas turbine mm -hmm. we're about to waste wood gas but that wood gas is going to go away today so the other thing we did before we blew everything up crazy has her ev um circuit assembler here now so she can now make what tier circuits elites or uh. masters Um, let me look that up. Okay. Um, I can now make, uh, I don't know, the extreme <clears throat> circuits. And they'll, yeah, I can make a nano computer. Okay, circuit. which is elite, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And one of these days when we get all of our circuit stuff done, I'm going to have crazy make us one of each of all the different types of circuits and we're going to kind of go over circuit progression for everybody in a video to try to make it a little more understandable because there's a lot of different changes you can do along the way and i don't know everybody uh is picking up on that what after mining and music the other day i went through and organized everything so we now have our materials are our elements are all here on the bottom level they're in periodic number since we don't have a periodic table up here so it runs from lithium to neodymium and then over here eventually will be for the uh, radioactive stuff we got a overflow box we need to deal with crazy needs to grab that nickel out of there and take it downstairs and then the next one is, we're full of nickel down there too. 
Yeah. Uh, we're full of nickel everywhere. The next level is materials, except for this one that I forgot to move. This is things that needs to be processed down to the elemental level that really has no use other than processing. And then the top is our gems and things that are not elements, but you use them at that level. So glowstone is up there. Redstone is up there. Even though redstone is processed down for rubies to make chrome, it's also used as redstone. So I threw it up there. Um, the red and yellow are only up there because we get them out of processing. They actually need to be sent in to be uh, recycled down to dust so we can get the material out of them. But for right now, they're up there. Graphite is up there. There's our diamonds, our emeralds, and our sapphires. That's the only level we're keeping of them. Everything that comes in that is chipped and flawed is automatically sent over. This, come, this pipe comes in from the sifter. If it's dust, it goes there. If it's regular, it goes there. Flawless is there, and exquisite is there. And if it can't go in any of those four, it goes up and it goes into this chest. And that goes straight into the macerator and gets turned into dust. Which comes out here at this point for smalls, which we need to get this set up today in the stream we're going to be doing here once we end this video. We moved our electrolyzers up from downstairs so they could be automated a bit. So we have our oxygen one, we have our fluorine one, this is our hydrogen one, ignore the hydrogen on the input because Bear messed up last night trying to fix some stuff, and this is our chlorine one. Back here is our um, no fluid output one, which I have no idea why I got oxygen in it, apparently Bear messed up. <clears throat> we had it up here. We had this nice throne looking thing, but due to this pipe here needing to be added, which I'll take you downstairs, show you here. This is the guts of the system. So everything comes down through this pipe. And if it is a oxygen cell, it gets put into this tank. It gets sent up. And... Um, or, sorry, it gets sent this way up through that pipe, and that puts it back into the empty cells back in. We just populated this one and this one with two stacks of cells. That way, it'll always keep two stacks of cells in both electrolyzers. And then if we never need to add on to it, we just have to populate the next one with another stack of cells and we can keep continuing to use that same one as long as that's the only fluid that comes out now we do need to if we have time today we need to set up a new electrolyzer for two things which is this one because we do not have one that puts out water cells and then there's also i don't know where it's at at the moment but there's another one that puts out water cells that we don't have a way of doing yet i may be able to um set that up here because i have this second one right here i may be able to set that up for water cells and we may be able to do it in the same one that we already have but we will see <clears throat> and i think that's about all we did yesterday because we spent or the day before yesterday because we spent a whole lot of time fixing shit um, and before yesterday's stream, Crazy got our distillation towers done. I built the building for the distillation tower room. And we built everything together except for these three. Crazy finished these three. We got the base done. She just needed to get the, uh, clean stainless steel casings done and she did that on her own in between streams so this is what we will be doing 
today. So in the next stream recap, you'll get to see how we hooked all these up. And I think that's it. So hit the buttons, do the things. Hope to see you in the next stream, which will be in like five minutes. <laughs> you won't see this before then, but yeah, have a good one. And the crazy one says...